Alright guys, so I, I apologize for all the noise. It's a parking lot right on the side of the highway, but uh, I want to talk to you guys today about a big hobby I had growing up, and that was RC trucks. I started off racing RC cars, custom built my own, painted and everything, and we were racing indoor carpet tracks. I sold that, I went to Nitro. Uh, as soon as I sold that one, I went to the trucks. I, everything I bought was Traxxas, and it still is. But I had a uh, Traxxas Nitro RC truck, and I just didn't like our, the Nitro stuff, so I got rid of them, and I started buying some battery-powered Traxxas trucks. And I'll show you the one it all started with. It all started with this. It's the Traxxas Slash 4x4. Um, I got a GoPro mount. I've got the mounts at home. I got my GoPro, but I don't have any of the attachments. But this is where it started. This is all where it started from. Uh, Traxxas, my opinion, Traxxas by far makes the best product. So, Traxxas Slash 4x4. My kids saw that one and wanted one of their own, so I got on the Traxxas Bigfoot. It's a 4x4 as well, designed after Bigfoot. My kids like it, but it's more of a crawler. It's got speed, so I put a really bar on it, but it's meant for off-roading. Uh, since my kids had a crawler, I want to make a course in the backyard. I wanted to buy a crawler, which is where the Traxxas Bronco comes in. It's a Bronco kit. It's a T. I believe it's a TRV4. I'll tell you guys later for sure, and uh, later in the video. But I'm pretty sure it's a TRV4. It's the Bronco version, but it's a crawler. It's got four-wheel drive, diff lock. And it's it's made to crawl. So now I can set the course up in the backyard, and me and the kids can go out and play. The. Uh, Slash 4x4 is off-road, but it's mainly meant for like racing type stuff, faster speeds. So, you know, I got that one because I liked it out of the box with the second pinion that they give you, the second gearing, you should be able to do about 70 miles an hour with it. Um, once you get that fast, I gotta make some modifications. Once you start getting that fast, it gets really shaky in the front end. But I wanted you to bring you guys out here in the parking lot, kind of show you guys this side of some of my passions. You guys seen paranormal stuff, you guys know I'm into fishing, hiking, exploring, you know, kind of getting out there, but I like doing this stuff too. So sit back, enjoy a little bit of RC driving.
so this one's a little bit slower the Bronco but it's made for crawling it's made for off-roading so check it out But I don't feel like walking through all the grass to put the truck over there. But that's a little bit of messing around with the trucks. I'm gonna go back to a quieter place and we can kind of talk more about it. Hi guys, so this is the Traxxas slash 4x4 by far the fastest truck I have. Again, like it says, four wheel drive, it's off road racing. It's what we built for, so it's extremely capable of handling anything. Traxxas Slash. Like I said before, Traxxas is a really good brand. I fell in love with them. They make really good parts. Straight out of the box, they're extremely durable. That's why I don't mind letting kids play with them. You know, they are expensive, but the parts are, you know, they're built to withstand. You know, granted, you can't go 70 miles an hour into the wall and not break anything, but normal flips, rolls, stuff like that really don't break anything. The parts are extremely accessible. And there's a ton of aftermarket parts for Traxxas. That's why I love them. And like I said, extremely capable of off-road racing. That's what this thing is made for. And it's fun to go fast, especially off-road. Alright guys, up next is the Traxxas Bigfoot. The 4x4. Again, it's made for crawling. It's got 30 miles per hour out the box. But it's made to crawl, go off road. So again, Traxxas, big foot 4x4 edition. Straight out the box, you know, 30 miles per hour. Which is plenty fast enough for a kid. Plenty fast enough for anybody that's buying the truck for what it's meant for, which is off-road crawling. You noticed off to the side of the camera, I got this little pile. The, the Traxxas Slash that got hung up a little bit because of the ground clearance and because it's, not, it's mainly meant for high speeds. This crawled right over it with little problems to none. Um, like I said, I was talking about, it's got the wheelie bar on the back, so upgraded parts are easily accessible, as well as standard stock Traxxas parts. It's another reason I like it for the kids. 
can't go wrong for the price. The Traxxas Slash Outdoor is about over, a little over 500 bucks. This thing outdoor is about 200. Let's check on the Bronco. Uh, so now you got Traxxas TR TRV4 Bronco Edition. Now, higher speeds, it doesn't really have. It doesn't go that fast, but it's meant for crawling. And this is a higher end crawler. So it has a lot of different features and we're going to talk about that in a minute. So a little bit about the Bronco is it's got two speeds. It's on slow right now, it has high, which I was using at the beginning. It also has a switch on top for front diff lock or all diffs. And then you can lock all the diffs, which really makes crawling easier. It's also completely waterproof like the Slash 4x4. Uh, the Bigfoot has a couple waterproof components, but the motor itself is not. But the Bronco and the Slash 4x4 are all waterproof. Completely waterproof, you can take it in the water, you know, don't have to worry about it. Um, like I said, this has got two modes, slow and fast, and it's also got the diff lock, so, you know, it's extremely capable. Like the Slash, this is about 550 out the door, so this is, you know, a little more expensive for a kid, but top quality if you really want to get out and have some fun with some, some adult, have some grown-up boy fun. Uh, that's pretty much the end of the the Trax the toys I have right now, I plan on getting more. Like I said, Trax this makes great products. I love their trucks, I love their products. You know, the, the accessibility of the parts, you can go anywhere and get parts. Um, I know there's no other, you know, well known, maybe just as good quality, depending on who you talk to, as Trax is out there. But parts are not always the easiest to find. Trax's names are everywhere. You, you cannot go into a hobby shop without seeing the Trax's name, so parts are everywhere can't recommend them enough like I said this is you know this is for me playing as an adult growing up into adulthood I'm not getting paid by Traxxas I got 20 subscribers you really think Traxxas is gonna pay somebody like me so this is not paid at all this is me loving Traxxas and wanting to show support to the company and hopefully turn you guys on to something that's quality product 